Hey, what's going on, you guys? I'm Flipparts, and welcome to this awesome supply drop opening video. Now, I say it's awesome because I have a very, very good feeling about these supply drops here. I feel like there's just something good in them. Maybe it's just me, maybe there's nothing good in them, but we won't know until we open them up. But before we do, I just want to say, if you guys aren't following me on Twitter and you guys don't know the news just yet, thank you guys so, so much, because without you guys, this channel has finally hit over 30,000 subscribers. You guys, 30,000 of you guys watching these videos, this is just phenomenal amazing I, I don't even know what to say every time there's a new subscriber every single time I check my mail and things like that it's just amazing that there's people subscribing all the time and you guys are crazy you guys are just awesome and thank you guys so much without you guys this would not be possible and I wouldn't be able to do really what I'm able to do and you guys are just amazing so thank you guys so so much for all your love and support I cannot believe it so I've been trying to think of something to celebrate you guys at 30,000 K or 30,000 30, K 30,000 subscribers for subscribing to this channel what to do to celebrate you guys coming over here and just enjoying what I do so I've been thinking maybe I should do like a life in a flip arts or like a day in the life of flip arts or something like that not exactly wanting to do a draw my life just yet I don't feel like I've hit that kind of threshold yet where I feel like my life was just super exciting or anything I mean my, my life's been pretty dull up until this point I mean you guys I've made my life so much, so much better, and you guys have just been great. So I've been trying to think of something to do for 30000 I don't know what to do just yet, but if you guys have any kind of suggestions, feel free to leave them down in the comments below. Let's open up these supply drops here because you guys are just amazing. So let's go. We have one advanced supply drop, four regular supply drops. I usually have like five or six, but I've just been really busy this week. And uh, as you guys know, we're going to open up the advanced supply drop. Let's go. I feel something good. Give me something. Nope, you're not gonna give me anything. That's all right. We'll just go to our regular supply jobs. That's where I, I main. I main a bulldog face hammer. Oh, maxed out damage plus two accuracy. I, I might have a favorite shotgun. I used to like the sledgehammer just because it was like named kind of, I guess, like after the people who made this game, but. Mm, I mean, it doesn't look like I can put any attachments on it, but man, who cares with that kind of damage? Mm, and that accuracy, though. We also got an Atlas Contractor helmet, just for those of you that care. Um, it actually looks pretty decent, so that's nice. And we got an Orbo Care Package, which we won't talk about, but let's continue on here with the next one. Long Rifle Reinforcement and a NA45 Hurried. We got one. Oh, we got two more here. Right, I was so excited by that first one. Elite! Elite! And a Maz Ignition. I think I have the Maz Ignition already. Can't hate on it, but we got a Sentinel Covert Helmet. I don't think I have this one already, or it's been a really, really long time since I've last had one. And I believe this helmet is basically the same as, like, the Sentinel Operator Helmet or, or the... One of the, the ones you get for prestiging in this game. I can't remember exactly which one it is, but um, this looks... Pretty much like the same one, but with a visor thing over the front. But either way, pretty cool. Now we got one more here. Everything's been going up Mill House, so I've been enjoying this. And just a KVA Mercenary Bandana. Not too bad, not too shabby. Either way, Sentinel Covert Helmet, a Maz Ignition, which I think I already have. I'm pretty sure I do. And then we got this Bulldog Face Hammer. Gonna have to make a game plan on that or something. But either way, thank you guys for watching, and I can't wait to see you guys in the next clip of this video. This is gonna be pretty exciting so thank you again for the 30,000 subscribers that are on this channel and growing every every day so uh see you guys in just a little bit for the next clip all right guys i've got four regular supply drops here it would have been about five but for whatever reason i can't get into a single match of mosh pit and then we've got an advanced supply drop here from prestiging let's hop right in see what we get hopefully it's awesome stuff I'm really feeling it and Elite. I Atlas Orbital Loadout, I already have, but I always love seeing Atlas Orbital stuff. They just look great. It's, 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 a, it's a really good uh, wear gear to have, the Atlas Orbital set. Something I've never been able to complete, uh, but still, nonetheless, we got 10, nope, sorry, 25 minutes of rapid supply. Clearly, I cannot read today uh, from being so angry that I can't complete a goddamn supply drop challenge. And we are just getting Elite. almost nothing. A Maelstrom or Maelstrom Loadout. I finally got one. I have not been able to complete this set at all. This is the first Maelstrom anything I've had in like maybe like 20 episodes or something like that. Jesus. All right. Maelstrom loadout. Not bad. The Atlas Orbital is also something I can't complete. So there's that. All right. Come on. We got, what is that? One more left. We got one more left. And I'm, I'm feeling it. I'm just, come on. 
We got this. We got this. We got this. We got this. Elite. We got this. An MK14 Eclipse. Now, there's nothing wrong with an MK14 Eclipse. I mean, look, it has plus one damage, plus two accuracy, negative one fire rate. That's not a big deal. I mean, if you got a trigger finger, not a big deal. And a negative two handling, I mean, no one knows what handling does. I've given up on trying to vouch for handling ever since the whole finger trap thing. But either way, not that bad. I mean, we got an Atlas Orbital loadout. I already have it. Me. We got the Maelstrom loadout, very, very awesome. And then we got an MK14 Eclipse, meh. But we'd also have the 25 minutes of Rapid Supply, which is very, very awesome as well. Gonna have to get some more. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hopefully I can complete my Supply Drop challenges. Otherwise, I have no clue. This is gonna be a lot harder on me to get more Supply Drops for you guys. So either way, see you guys in a little bit. All right, here we go again. Let's see what we get here. Elite! An Atlas 45 Oath Breaker. And it's supposed to be best in handling, so I guess a plus two isn't so bad. I, I, I mean, it looks pretty cool. Look at it. I mean, it's like gold, or like a really diminished kind of gold. Very rustic looking. Pretty decent, but I mean, not exactly what I'm looking for. Fetching reward in progress. Elite! Another Tiger Blood. Interesting, very, very interesting, but we got 10 minutes of double XP, which is always good. I think this is probably like the best part of the reinforcements, either getting the XP or the rapid supply, but I mean, I, I usually get like the care package thingy, orbitals, whatever, uh, but that was nice. We got the uh, S12 Tiger Blood. I don't know if my supply drops are broken today or something. Is it going to fetch my reward or probably looking to give me all the poopy items or something? I have no clue. I mean, I can't choose from either one, which is a mad disappointment. It's like they know that I'm I'm doing this because this is what I do on the YouTubes. And they're just like, no, no. All right, so I had to reset just so I could open up my supply drops. Lo and behold, there is nothing very good in them whatsoever. I don't understand why the KVA Mercenary Gloves are enlisted. Because I think, like, the KVA Mercenary set is all professional. And then the gloves are enlisted, which makes no sense to me. Uh, but let's open up the last one here so I can get some more. Video. And 10 minutes of rapid supply, followed by a freaking orbital care package. Nonetheless, I think it was a decent opening. We got the Oathbreaker. We got a Tiger Blood, which I already got. And I, I guess that's it. And then we got the double XP and the 10 minutes of rapid supply, which isn't too bad. But uh, the duplicates are real. Especially with royalty coming to Xbox One first. That's just some ridiculousness. But still, I mean, the duplicates are, are for real. But either way, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Probably the final clip for this video. And uh, until then, see you soon. Alright you guys, going in with the final three supply drops and advanced supply drop for this video. It's been a real pain trying to get these videos done because I can't even do my daily challenges anymore. I don't know what's going on with the servers, things like that. If you guys haven't seen the video that I put out called No Games Found, you guys should go check it out. I'll leave an annotation link somewhere on screen or a link down in the description below. You guys can go and check it out on the channel. But either way, let's just open these up right here and see what we get in a Pythic Methodic AK-12 Theater, which isn't... I mean, it's, <sighs> let's just not talk about that. And then we also got an Atlas Vigilante sunglasses or whatever. Regular supply drops, here we go. Home watches, which I, uh, I do not have as well. I have yet to buy the Seasons Pass or the map packs or anything like that. I just haven't had the time to want to go and actually buy it. I don't know. I mean, I could go and buy it. I just no, I just don't feel like I, I need to buy it right now. I, it's just not as interesting to me. We got Pytech Eradicator and 10 minutes of XP. So that's pretty awesome. We got two more to go here. And I'm, I'm really hoping for something good, but it seems very slim. My luck, everything is just not going up real nicely for me with everything just going on. So, I mean, this is it. And it looks like this one's not even going to open for me either, which is very anticlimactic. And I'm sure once I get it open, it's still going to be anticlimactic. So... <sighs> and anticlimactic as I thought. We got a 10 minutes of rapid supply. We've been getting a lot of rapid supplies, a lot of double XP, which is nice, but... 
it's just not cutting it. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, please hit the like button down below. And if you're new, subscribe. Thank you guys for pulling through with me. I know I could have had more supply drops, things like that. It's just not going well for me. But hopefully everything works out by next week. Maybe there's a patch for the PS4. I don't know. But either way, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. So later days, and peace out.